Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The T-72 BM-2 represents Belarus's enhancement of the Soviet T-72B tank lineage, building upon the prior T-72 BME iteration first showcased in 2017. Although the T-72 BME didn't see adoption by the Belarusian army and failed to attract production orders, it was marketed to potential export customers. The T-72 BM-2, introduced to the public in 2022, features a new add-on armor kit and an improved fire control system. Aligned closely with the Russian T-72B3 variant, the Belarusian upgrade boasts superior armor capabilities. However, it appears to lag behind in engine power and mobility compared to its Russian counterpart. The new add-on armor kit, developed domestically in Belarus, bears resemblance to the Russian relict explosive reactive armor of the third generation. This additional armor enhances protection against both kinetic energy munitions and explosively formed penetrators, covering a larger area of the hull and turret compared to the Russian T-72B3. Additionally, cage armor is installed at the rear of the hull. The fire control system includes upgraded sights, notably the Sosna U gunner's sight equipped with a thermal imager, enabling day-slash-night and all-weather combat capabilities. While lacking a panoramic commander's sight common in modern Western main battle tanks, the tank commander can designate targets, with the gunner handling the aiming and firing process. Retaining the 125mm main gun with an automatic ammunition loading mechanism, the upgraded tank maintains the capability to launch 9M119 or 9M119M gun-launched anti-tank guided missiles, boasting a maximum range of 4 km. However, despite developers' claims of an 80% first-round hit probability, demonstrations have revealed inconsistencies in target accuracy. With 45 rounds of onboard ammunition, including gun-launched missiles, the tank's secondary armament comprises a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun and a roof-mounted 12.7mm machine gun. Operated by a crew of three, including the commander, gunner, and driver, the T-72 BM-2 is outfitted with a new engine, likely the Russian V-84 MS diesel engine producing 840 horsepower. While its mobility and engine power may fall short compared to the Russian T-72B-3, the T-72 BM-2 features upgraded gearbox and suspension components to accommodate the increased power. Additionally, the T-72 BM-2 can be equipped with a deep wading kit, enabling it to ford water obstacles up to 5 meters deep. That's all for now. See you later.